Friday Sprints on Friday, January 10th. I am the co-host for, not January, February. I'm pretty sure I just said that whole intro. Dang it. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Like, I've never co-hosted anything in my entire life, so, like, this is gonna be so much fun. So, like, please come chill with me on February 10th. It's a Friday. Y'all don't have anything to do on a Friday. We don't have social lives here. It's fine. It's fine, okay? Please come. Please. Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I'm here with some very exciting news. There is a readathon going on from February 6th, so today, until Sunday, February 12th, and it is called the TBR Takedown 5.0. It was originally created by Shannon over at Leaning Lights. So I'll leave her link down below if you want to check it out, and I'll also leave the Twitter down below. I'm pretty sure they're running sprints over there. But, exciting news, I get to co-host this year, and I'm super excited. Basically, I'm going to be running sprints over on my channel. If you want to see what I'm doing on Friday, February 10th. If you want to follow me, you know, it's right here. Just, you know, follow me. I'll also leave the link down below if you want to go follow me, because that's what I said you should do, so. <laughs> so, if you're interested in seeing what's going on and joining, then follow me, and then we can have a party. A reading party. I've never co-hosted anything, so this might be like a total flop, or it could be totally fun. We don't know. I mean, like, I'm pretty awkward, so it should be interesting, at least. So if you guys want to participate, then you have to use the hashtag TBR Takedown. I'll be tweeting. I'm pretty sure the TBR Takedown account will be tweeting. I don't know, but we'll see. But I'm super excited. So now, on to my TBR pile. Which will be interesting. There's a couple of challenges that you're supposed to try to do during this readathon. So without further ado, let us get started. <sighs> the first challenge is a book on your TBR for over a year. I could honestly pick any book that I wanted for this, but I picked one that everyone's telling me I need to read. And it is The Night Circus by Aaron Morgenstern. It's gonna happen. Hold me to it. On Friday, tweet me and be like, Jay, have you read The Night Circus yet? And I will probably say no. But if you tweet me beforehand, then maybe I'll actually pick it up. Next challenge is your most recent book haul. So I picked Winner's Curse by Marie Rutowski. I just got this like two weekends ago at the book outlet. So I got the whole trilogy. So I'm actually very excited to read this because I've heard great things, great things. The next challenge is to read a first book in a series. And I'm just going to slowly bring this up here so you all can love me again. I'm just gonna hold it here. It might happen, guys. This might be the day that this happens. Hold me to this one, too. Tweet me. <laughs> Let me make me read this. The next challenge is to catch up on a series, and I am going with A Wind Witch by Susan Dennard. I just read Truth Witch last month, so, you know, it just makes sense to go on to the second book in the series. The next challenge is to read a book out of your comfort zone. This book isn't necessarily, like, out of my comfort zone, like, genre-wise. It's in my comfort zone. But the way it's out of my comfort zone is because it's ginormous. And it is the Pendulum by Adam Hamdi, and I recently got this book, and it just sounds so cool. Basically, this guy's in this room, and then the only thing he can see is the guy who's about to kick the chair out from under him because he has a noose around his neck. Like, like what? It just sounds so cool, but like it's ginormous. So out of my comfort zone, definitely will probably not finish it for a readathon because you know you're supposed to read quickly, but it's fine. We're going with it. So there you go. Alright guys, so there was my TBR. Again, if you want to follow me on Twitter to get some sprints in, then I'll leave it down below. It's also going to be on the screen again, but I would totally love it if you would join me and we can have a little reading party. I'm super excited, and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!